um, hi guys, um, someone asked for a marking tutorial, so, um, here it is. Um, sorry if my mic's a bit wonky, it's a new bike, so. Okay, I'm trying to talk to it because it can be really loud. So, I'm sorry for everyone who's using headphones right now. The editing app that I'll be using is, is CapCut. So, for CapCut, it can be, um, a bit tricky to do the masking. So, what we're going to need is, like, a nice and clear background i recommend to go in this area um this is like a good area to get a good masking next i'm just gonna remove the player tags my player tag oh whoops okay it's not working i will be back when it does work so turns out i had to actually leave and rejoin the server but now i'm back I actually took a while and it worked i guess so now i am in this nice and clear spot okay that's good and i'm gonna just search up a random things okay so now i'm just gonna go and record my clip okay so now i have my clip let's head into CapCut. i've recorded my clip so next thing i'm gonna do i'm gonna tap on that clip and set have a look for a cutout and tap on remove background and just wait for it to load if you this does not work um and and you are a CapCut pro um i'm unfortunately not if you're a CapCut pro just like um cut it out on your own It'll be way easier and it'll look all good. Next step is I'm gonna add this overlay, which is coming on the screen. Um, so screenshot this. I think it's enough time to screenshot, right? <laughs> okay, so now I've added the overlay. I'm gonna size it for the whole entire clip and put it just like that. And it should look like this. And then I'm gonna tap on the overlay and blend and press burn. Just like this. And then I'm going to go into the uh, main clip. I'm going to scroll until I see adjust. And if you'd like, screenshot this. I have to write this down because it was hard for me to remember. The brightness to 22. And contrast to minus 18. So saturation to 21. And exposure to 22. There. Should be looking like this. So we're going to export this. And then I'm going to go back into the project. So next I'm going to uh, delete this. And I'm going to um, re-add this exact same clip. Except um, with the, the background on. So now I have the original clip. And I'm going to add um, the exact same clip that we just exported. If that sounded all weird. This is what I mean. I'm going to resize it so it can be the exact same. And it, it has to be um, in sync. So it looks like this. And this is the last part. Just um, tap on the overlay, head into blend, press filters, and I'm going to make this a little bit bigger. Here's the masking, and here's how my turn turned out. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye!